Hello and welcome back to Big Jules Tech. Well, I just want to do a quick unboxing today, a quick review. Uh, we've gone out and bought this Wi-Fi router adapter extender. So extend your Wi-Fi anywhere in your home from BT. This is the Essentials Wi-Fi Extender 300. Um, and because what we've found since we've started putting some more devices in the property, there is a bit of a, a dead spot at the back in the bedroom. So this is plug and play. It is literally, hopefully you plug it in and you will then see the benefits of an extended reach of your Wi-Fi and your wireless broadband. So I'm going to unbox it, show you exactly what you get in the box and then we'll see exactly how it is. We've just got this from Argos for $19.99, just looking online, Amazon, it's $19.99, um, going up to $24.99. So the prices vary, so £20, um, I don't think it should do too bad. So let's see exactly what you get in the box. So first of all, the user guide and the instructions on how to use it, and then the device itself. As you can see there, UK adapter, extender bars, to be able to give you that extra reach. So, there we go, as simple as that. And hopefully the instructions will literally say, plug it in, pair it to your Wi-Fi, and away you go. So I'll stick this in and let's see exactly how it does. So here we are in the living room. It says to come to the room where your router is. So I've come in here and basically if you've got a WPS button that you can press on your router to pair it up to your extender, then it's really, really simple. It says literally, plug it in in the room that you're gonna be with your router in and turn it on. So the instructions for the WPS button, which I've got the SkyQ router box, so I'm using the WPS method. There is another one where you can go to the internet browser and set it up manually, but I don't need to do that. So plug in the router in the power socket near your broadband and then in the same room, wait 10 seconds for the extender to boot up. The light will be flashing red slowly. Then it says press the WPS button on your router and within two minutes um, press it on the extender and it should then pair up. So WPS button on the router, WPS button on the extender and now we've got amber so Wait for the light to stop flashing. Solid green, amber or red. The extender is now configured with your hub and router and you're ready to find it optimum location. So basically, once it's configured to the router, then you can go to another room and use it as an extender. Amber means that you're too close. Red means that it's too far. And green means it's an optimum location. And what it suggests in here is that you actually go halfway between here and where you want the actual Wi-Fi extender and then you'll be able to uh, see if it's those three colours. And that's it. So let's give it a go and see if it boosts our Wi-Fi in the other room and actually give it a running test. So now it's telling me we're too close because that's here. So super, all sorted. So now I'm in the far side of the house in our bedroom, which is the furthest room away. Uh, and I'm going to plug this in. And see what it says. So we have a flashing red light. Ideally, I want it to go green, but it might be too far away from the router. There we go, we have a green light. So 
Now I've got Wi-Fi extended all the way to the far side of the house. I'm really pleased that that didn't go red. Um, basically all you need to do now is link things to this, which is the same as whatever your identifier is for your internet with EXT in front of it. So ours is some random sky number, then EXT in front of it and put it to that. So let's give that a go and see exactly how we get on. So there we go. That's just a quick overview as to exactly what the, uh, the Wi-Fi extender has done for us. I would say that is probably, we're in a bungalow, that's probably about 12 metres from the router all the way through to the uh, bedroom where it's gone and it's giving a really strong signal now. So that's through four, three, four really solid walls as well. So I'd say it'd easily go upstairs and it'd easily go to the other side of the house um, for a normal property. So overall, I'm really happy with this. Um, I would highly recommend it because it's worked straight out of the box first time, was really easy to set up and it was very reasonably priced. So it's one of the cheaper ones that uh, I've seen and it's readily available. So links are in the description below if you want to have a look exactly at the one that I got. But uh, altogether, thanks very much for watching and hopefully we'll catch you in the next one.